are really kind of a strange group, this ECTA Europe group, because um, we were being brought together basically by Rajagopal some 15 years ago, and it's quite unusual. Usually, you know, the development organizations uh, in the quote north, they become involved and they decide we should support, you know, this initiative in the south, which Gajagopal, it was the other way around. He had established all these contacts in different countries in Europe and, uh, you know, abroad, and he brought us together. It was his secret plan in this center in southern India, and slowly out of this meeting where some of the old timers who are still with us from the UK, from France, etc., were also there, that this network called ECTA Europe developed. So we are a funny organization. I'm the president. I've never been elected. We don't know how they do it in France tonight. Mm. But um, so we are a very loose group. And funnily enough, without really a, a fixed organization, People always insist that they want to meet twice a year. It's a little bit like a class reunion, which uh, sometimes maybe is not so good. But we meet in the spring and in the fall. And we come and we decide on some joint action we want to do and we want to inform each other about what every organization does. Some of our organizations have different tasks, like I have uh, some colleagues here also from France. Um, they, organize, they support different actions in their countries, but they also support the work of Ecta Parishad and the non-violence um, action that Ecta Parishad stands for in terms of its mobilization uh, and conscientization work. You will hear much more about this. And this is also the part, I think, that has brought our organization organizations together in this loose network, which is a very important group, as we are embarking quite ambitiously yeah. on a global action in the year 2020, which is, has already started in India, where we want to change the world. Mm -hmm. And I tell you something, we need you. We need your support because, uh, uh -huh. you know, we can't do it without Sweden. So with this, I would like to pass on uh, the word to Jill, who will uh, tell you more about this Jagat as it is developing and, and what we are planning. It's really also exciting. And then uh, Rajagopal will get the word to talk.